Welcome to another Field of Glory 2 Digital League Battle. This is Season 10, High Middle Ages, Division A. In this match against Exley Joan, I have my Polish with Baltic Tribes allies against his Teutonic Order with Polish allies. Okay, so given the nature of the terrain, these hills and rough and forests I have, uh, one approach I could take would be to grab a whole bunch of ranged troops and kind of hang out. Uh, but I've decided to do something riskier and definitely more fun. I have this downward slope, and there's a whole lot of open terrain. So I have maxed on my knights and cavalry and got a fair number of impact foot, and we're going to charge. <laughs> that's, that's it. We grabbed four units of light infantry, our single unit of light horse, and our ranged and non-knightly horse as well. And we're going to charge. If he hides in terrain, that's no big deal. We have Baltic Foot. If he tries to stand off and shoot, well, with Skirmishers, we'll hopefully run them down. And with non-lights, we can just smash into them. If he's gone with a lot of knights, we'll have to match our knights to his knights and then roll our impact foot into his infantry. That's the plan, anyway. We'll see if it works out at all like that. All right, let's see that force comp and deployment. Lots of lights. Lots of knights. Six, seven, six. Um, wait. <laughs> uh, no, six. Okay, there we go. Defensive spearmen. Crossbowmen. So, we'll want to match our knights to his knights, and then just charge, basically. That's rough ground, we have that lined up. Okay. Our own lights will just exist to foul up his lights enough. Get these knights moving off to confront this pile of knights with noble cavalry, mounted crossbowmen for flank action. Got three knights there. So, probably want to shift our own knights over to confront them. So, we have what? Three confronting our two knights, and then three confronting our three knights. Okay, that'll do. I'm not a bad person, I don't play with the group all the time, but sometimes you need it. And let's try to get this light cavalry in behind his army. Might even try to do that with the noble cavalry. Alright, and next turn we can try to straighten things out, because he'll take a bit of time to get forward enough to force us to move quickly. Next turn. Straight at us, then. Fair enough. Get lights forward. Okay, what are we doing over here? What a jumbled mess. Three, four, five, six knights, that's right. Get in line with that forest. 
now we have knights lined up against knights. Our screen is ready, such as it is. And we'll have knights move up in support of the impact foot. Okay, if the defensive spearmen have to take the brunt of the shooting here. You just have to protect the cavalry from it. Okay, straight on to contact. Next turn. Oh, we get shot at, possibly to disruption. We'll see. Not let crossbowmen seize that forest. That's unacceptable. Right, keep arcing behind, and we can start closing in and booking casualties. Go for the long flank. It's general up here, you push forward, and let's have our Baltic foot advance. Push for this forest, and let's see. Some pressure on his skirmishers. Advance. Start trying to push into charge range. Good. Shove him out of there. Or not, that's fine. Let's drive them along. These units are a distraction anyway. Do I want to do that? I would get charged by knights. Probably not the best idea. Hold them back. Advance the knights. We'll need the infantry to fight crossbowmen if possible. Reaching them is going to be awkward. Ugh, I am concerned about the front. Hopefully we can tear things up here when we get into contact. Next turn. I'm okay with him shooting at the infantry. I don't like shooting at the knights. to veer off here then.
No, we don't care about that. Okay, well, continue to ride around to the back. Same with you. And get these knights into charge range. What do we want to pick at? I suppose we can pick at them. Then what? Here? Hmm. on to try to even things out or you know that gonna flank off here and can either grab the hill or block them with the infantry and threaten the flank next turn that'll do run away and just harass these knights and keep them distracted. We'll lose both of these units, but at least we are distracting a number of units and we just need to hope that that is enough. Not much to do with this unit, but I'll keep it here so when things open up we can move into the crossbowmen. Hopefully. Here, if we charge, we might open ourselves up to getting flanked, so instead maybe it would be best to general up and go for a disrupt or something. Frag, very nice. Pylon then. I dispersed, that's better. Now let's keep it up. Maybe I was hoping to follow up into the crossbows, but not yet, it seems. Let's get out of the way. And then go for a nightly charge here. Nope. Then try with the infantry. No, and we're blocked in from the fallback. Hopefully we don't lose. Follow that up. Now we can fall back if we need to. Stand here, probably get shot at. Maybe even to disrupt, but we just need to delay these knights. Okay. Decent start. That's a bit ugly, but still alright. Next turn. Ooh, that is very unfortunate. Probably frag. Oh no. <laughs> Looks like the right wing is going to cave quite a bit faster than I wanted. Right then, let's fight this combat. Confirm, get this disrupted unit out of here. Too bad. Um, charge to try to get out of trouble. Maybe we'll break them. If not, we'll just lose this unit. Good. 
Now he can probably still double charge and drop them, but at least they got some use out of them. Ooh. All right. We need to start pulling as many units out of here as possible because they're all going to go soon. Well, this is hideous, but... That's more like it. Let's see, who do we want command on? Why don't we... Look a few more casualties. Then go in for impact. Too bad, but then we can shuffle back into place, or... Mm. Get ready for another charge here. Unless I want these knights to move over and help stabilize things and trust to the impact foot to get it done. That might be wise. Take cover in the rough. Push forward. Push forward. There. Make your way around. Behind. And impact charge. Bounce. We'll have to try again. Hmm, now I'm feeling less comfortable. Next turn. Oh, I thought he'd go for the flank charge. So he'll just shoot them to death instead. That works. And a break, I assume. Yeah, too bad. Good, we're in rough ground. Ooh, should have seen that. Do we at least hold out long enough for me to get a flank? No. Good. completely mismanaged the situation here. Let's get you out. Move you to reinforce. Disruption, but will it matter in time? Not at this rate. So if I charge here, then he could roll me or roll me. They're both bad options. Um, run for help, I suppose, and get the hell out of there. Uh, and because both these op options are bad, what do I do? I could charge and accept. I could try to support there. It's all terrible. We'll just need to get in and hope for best, which is never a good sign. We're gonna get flanked by crosswomen here. Hopefully we just disrupt, and that wouldn't be so bad. Go for impact. Good, frag. Go for impact again. Held firm. Hopefully we'll bounce off without too much damage then. 
Uh, next up, we can try to work on the Spearman while the Knights cycle charge. And we bounce. What about... I might block my fallback here. Well, we're going to risk it anyway and we'll shuffle out of the way next turn. Yeah, none of those were very impressive impacts. Alright, keep arcing around. And raw spearmen, we're just going to have to start engaging them, I suppose. We don't have any more time to mess around. So these were kind of unfortunate. Hopefully we don't suffer for it. And I'm hoping they only disrupt and then we can break through here before this gets even worse. Next turn, very ugly on my right wing. At least it's not a flank, but yeah, do we frag here or hold it disrupted? Good. Yeah, okay. Double drop. Hmm, at least we can get an impact charge back in. Break. Good. Good, and hopefully we get these knights back under control soon. He'll charge him from behind with the lights and overrun the mounted crossbowmen. Let's go for, well, first of all, take cover. Then, hmm, do we get a frag here? Nope. How are we with this? Pretty outnumbered. Plus 75 POA, though. Yeah, get you away. Maybe we need to get away here as well. Yeah, probably those crossbowmen. Plus, do I would need to cover this flank? Might need to if I want to try to at least break that unit. Too bad. Well, there's no sense even trying to save this unit now. We fall back here. Don't need to block this charge. Right, to do this before the knights get engaged. It's fine. Good. Do we want to general up here? Yeah, let's do that. And impact charge. Held firm. Too bad here and threaten a flank. All right, you guys. Yeah, threaten those crossbowmen from here. Down 13%, it's pretty bad. Next turn, start a rally. Oh, on those knights I was so hoping to break. A pursuit charged. They held firm. Ugh. Covered the medium foot, of course. Yep, and piling on to take out the mounted crossbow then.
Oh, at least we didn't frag. They're pursuing, so that shouldn't really matter. Interesting choice. Does he pull it off? Not quite. Good. But we didn't pursue into this flank because of this charge, so maybe it was worth it. Good. Well. Next turn, then. Nope. No again. Work on them. See if we fall back here. Not yet. unit. Fine, go for a charge here. Good. Run off then. Can't save them. Say goodbye. Same here. Uh, looking very bad. I mean, this is nice and all, but I don't think it'll make up for the total loss of the rest of the army. Next turn. Oh no. Yeah, you're supposed to win that thing. <laughs> Guess I didn't get the memo. Defensive spearmen. They held firm, but they got no impact POA from that. Any checks? Yes. the hell out of there. It is not looking good. That helps a little. We will slaughter these disrupted crossbowmen. They are disordered anyway, even before contact, because they are fighting into the forest. Go for a freak general kill. No. Okay. And shoot up these unprotected axemen and prepare for impact. You're doomed. Not yet. Get a break. Let's charge these routers and then... No. Fine. Fine. Bounce off. need to get disruptions so it unlocks our swordsman POA. Disruptions in the enemy, that is. 
we're gonna, let's see, I think lurk uphill so we can turn around and threaten to sweep down on any attempts to get into our rear. But it is not looking good. Next turn. Interesting. I wonder how much that'll matter. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Just break through, damn. Come on, just do it. Held firm, get out of here. Auto break. Delicious vengeance. Okay. Now we could just do that, but why would we? Oh, well, we can set up that rear charge. Okay, post up on your hill. Held firm. The chances here are not so good because of the numbers. Oh, oh. Okay then. Well, if you're gonna break, break towards the back. And shoot again. No need to charge yet, so we can do it next turn. Next turn, it's almost over for us, but we'll get a few more breaks in for our dignity's sake. Really too bad that we didn't just run down those crossbowmen right away. Auto brakes. Now the part where everybody runs away. Yeah, okay. Um, here. Throw in one last volley of arrows before facing the enemy's lights, and then might as well charge. Damn. So much for impact, foot. Frag? Great. What about a break? No. What about you hold firm? Yes. Alright. Cut them up with your swordsman skill. Thank you. And we could try to engage from the front. It's not likely to work. And it didn't. That'll do. And what? I suppose we can start pelting these knights with rocks. Encourage them to move. Fortunately, this height is not super impressive. And yeah, I think we're still going to lose this, but at least we put a good bit of damage in. Next turn. Ah. 
Ah, we halt in close crossbow shot. He'll charge. Thought we would evade, but I guess we stood and fragged. Come on, just break them. I know it looks close, but he has this huge block of knights intact, and we don't. Well, get this break in. And see if that does anything. It does, but not enough. You'll need to run off. And uh, do we have anything that can stand against these knights? Not. Really, we have a bunch of Baltic foot and a couple scattered, badly weakened units of knights of our own. We're gonna push this way across the battlefield. Damn. Get out. What can you do? I suppose threaten the crossbowmen with charges. No terrain to hide in. Shove this way. You're on low ammo, so why not take some pot shots? Yeah, so technically we're winning, but I don't see where we could possibly get 5%, and I definitely see where he could farm 12%. Very tough battle. Yeah, it is, but I still think... Despite my ever so slight lead, I'm going to lose this due to what he has left as opposed to what I have left. Knights and crossbowmen versus a bunch of medium foot. Pretty sure that equals a whole bunch of dead medium foot. Setting up that flank. Uh. Oh! <laughs> Ouch, alright, there goes that lead. Held firm. Damn, I was hoping to break them, but it's not gonna happen. No rallies. Are they close to auto braking? No, they are not. Okay, what can we do here? around I guess could try for a charge to see what happens probably nothing good but at this point it's worth a shot next with Joan it is over I think <laughs> okay. Setting up the flank, nothing I can do to prevent it. Or that. Mighty 
need to pull these out. Uh, yeah. Run. Hold them off. We'll let's see. How can we threaten the flank without getting too dangerous a position? Maybe here. And shoot. And again, while we attempt. Yeah, let's close into range. Oh, you're so far. Work on that auto break. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Hold up. No way. All right. Uh, we might have just won the match. Unless he rallies, then we're still doomed. Right, so... Um, Apparently, I won. <laughs> Been moping a bit for the past. I don't even know how long in this game. But, uh, I guess an auto break for the win. Now, on the one hand, it was lucky that that unit auto break in the moment, auto broke in the moment, and that I didn't frag here. On the other hand, it was also lucky for XV Joe that his understrength unit didn't disrupt or even frag on impact with my impact foot. Uh, a very well done offensive, and you know he showed the value of missile troops here. I got shot to bits here. I got forced into undesirable melees, and in general, I lacked flexibility here. On the other hand, his spearmen in the flat really could not hold it together against knights, although they did cause some breaks against the Baltic Foot, who, if they fail to cause a drop on impact, are in a lot of trouble. Their swordsman POA is halved to 50 against steady spearmen. On top of that, they are medium foot, so they don't get that plus one to cohesion. So they are squishy and under POA if they don't cause a drop immediately. Had this gone on, I think it would have been ugly because I would have lost these knights. And the hope, I suppose, would have been trying to set up a flank here, but I don't think that would have happened. And this unit is close to auto break. Now, maybe I could have gone into melee against a crossbowman, but with more missile troops coming to shoot up my cavalry and knights on the way, I think it would have got ugly had it gone on. Now, this is such a ridiculously close match that I'm not going to score a full four points. Uh, X Legio will gain a well-deserved point, and I will get three points. So, a very good game to X Legio. Could have gone either way. Till next time.